There are three popular cannabis petitions on the Parliament of Canada's e-petition website asking the Liberals to remove taxes from medical weed, fulfill their campaign promise of legalizing cannabis, and allow recreational users to grow their own plants as part of the upcoming reform. The first petition, E18, was started by Sam Beekmans of Victoria, BC, and currently has nearly 17,000 signatures. It asks the federal government to immediately end cannabis prohibition, allow personal cultivation, repeal section 462.2 of the criminal code, which bans weed literature and harm reduction devices like vaporizers, and end police raids against medical cannabis dispensaries and enable their municipal regulation. E18 also asks that within one year, the Liberal government allow farmers to harvest and sell the cannabinoid-rich resin from their plants, as per the recent resolution of the Canadian Hemp Trade Alliance, and grant a full pardon and amnesty for past offenses, expunge criminal records, and release all prisoners currently serving time for cannabis. The second petition, E190, was created by Hillary Black of Vancouver, BC, and currently has more than 8,300 signatures. It asks the federal government to amend tax legislation to ensure medical cannabis is treated consistently with other medical necessities and is exempt from sales tax. It also points out that according to the current Excise Tax Act, by law, medical prescriptions cannot be taxed. The final petition, E115, was created by Chris Stewart of Fort Augustus PEI and currently has more than 1,400 signatures. It asks that personal cannabis cultivation be included as part of the upcoming reform. All three e-petitions have received the minimum required 500 signatures to be presented in the House of Commons, but more is always better. The petitions can be found at the Parliament of Canada website or in the description below. Citizens of other countries are able to sign them as well.